Alright everybody, welcome back to Hyper Light Drifter and um me trying desperately not to die. Okay. Alright, okay, okay. <laughs> These things are terrifying, my god. Oh god. Ugh, Jesus. Talk about inhospitable. Okay, so that that shut those things off, clearly. That thing in the cell to the left does not look nice. Okay. I don't know what's going to happen when I let this thing out, but... I'm scared. Oh god. Oh god damn! Ooh. If I had been facing him at the same time as anything else, it would have been very scary. I wonder if there's any point to destroying those crystals, because they seem to just respawn and then hurt you. That's a crystal monster, dude. Whoa! Ooh. That was scary. Well now, wait a minute, I want to go over here and kill this dude. Can I not do that? I guess not. This game's actually very unnerving and scary <laughs> to be playing blind. That son of a bitch shooting me. Asshole. God. Well, now I'm back to having no healing anymore. That was scary. Oh, God! Oh, man. I need healing. I need healing before I try and go back in there. Fuck. God damn. Oh, there it is. A healing thingy. Oh, thank god. Okay, now maybe I can go back there and try and tackle that room. Oh. Still have no idea what our goal is on this quest, but whatever. I just know we're collecting things to do things. Very unapologetically RPG of it. Alright. 
Lots of interest in there. What about in here? Money! Fuck you. I don't even know why I'm killing these people. What have they ever done? I'm sure it was explained to me in one of the little story time slideshow things that NPCs will communicate with you using. Oof. <laughs> that wasn't a very pleasant fate. He just uh, took a tumble off the cliff. Oh no. Okay. Right now we're going to go back the way we came and go down those stairs and see what horrible things await us there. Like, is this blood? Or is this like some sort of like magenta moss? It's bizarre. I would love to know the lore behind this game, if anything, but I realize that that would require a sacrifice of uh, enduring dialogue. Very scary. I, I went in there thinking it was just the three crystal giant dudes, and then all the little crystal bug things showed up out of nowhere, and I was like, oh fuck! God damn! Nice! Got all sorts of goodies. here. Although I don't think this is an improvement. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, whoa. Okay. Okay. Oh, whoa. Alright, that's where I came from. So now I'm going to go over here. Alright, what do we got? We're still in the crazy blue magenta forest with green crystals. It's very otherworldly color scheme. And I don't remember if we were here before. Okay, no. We gotta find some way to get to the other side of that, apparently. And we can't access the little climby, climby bits. There's a climbable wall right there, but can't get to it. Alright. Oh, oh, Jesus! What the fuck was that? Okay. Nasty. Ouch. Oh. It's the doggy. It's the diamond head doggy. It's 
Come back, doggy. Don't leave us. We love you. Okay. That doesn't sound good. What is that? It's an evildoer. Who the fuck is he? Is he a bad? Oh no, he's a he's a NPC of some sort. Oh, he's telling me where all the things are. Oh no, yeah, he's my he's my bro. He's the one that's like me. He's got a little little thing. And I have a little thing. Giggity. Uh, but not a good way. Um, let's see. Uh, okay, I can't get through there. All right. So he he just really all he really did just did was tell me where everything is. Okay. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna test my luck, I guess. I'm sure I'll get an ability later that will let me dash farther or something like that. That shit scares the bejesus out of me. I can't lie. Didn't I already go down here? I guess I just can't get through there. Well shit, I'm lost now. I don't know where I'm going. The only place I can really go is back down here. And I really don't want to do that, but... I think I made a shortcut for myself, so that's good, at least. I have that. Yeah, I can just cut back across here, and then bam, I'm back where I was. It's a very unsettling game to play blind, but it's actually really relaxing, too. I love the colors, and I love the ambient music. It's just... It's really nice. It's soothing in a weird way. I don't know. Can't explain it. Can I do anything new over here? Now? Perhaps? Huh. Oh, God. Okay, no, I don't think I came over here. These crystal things, like, they're really pretty, but they're nasty. My God.
Okay. I hate the way they grow back. That's kind of disturbing. I don't know why, but it's weird. Ouch. Okay, I just bit off more than I can chew there, I guess. Whoa, that's a long time ago. Now I gotta go all the way. God, fuck, fuck you. Jesus. Yeah, that whole brigade of assholes kicked my ass. I don't know what I was doing, what I was thinking. Oh, hey, a shortcut. Interesting. <gasps> a key thing. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> I wonder if someday in like the nuclear apocalypse the world looks like this. Like all the radiation has just turned the trees pink <laughs> and the grass is blue. Weird shit. Very bizarre. Yeah, spanked you guys that time. I was ready for ya. Asshole. Did I get the key thing from the key guy? Did I, was that before I died or after I died? I can't remember now. Oh wait, no, I got the key. It's right there. Cool. It took me a while to figure out how to read this game's inventory system. But once you get it figured out, it's not... It's not too difficult, it's just hard to tell still what things are. And the game never explicitly tells you what anything's for, it's just kind of got to figure it out for yourself. Oh, god damn it! Fucking crystals. I hate them. I don't know what I'm doing. Pew, pew, pew. 
I do not know what I'm doing. Oh, God damn it. It's really hard to tell if any of these crystalline structures are part of a puzzle or anything. They are fun to slash to pieces though. Who are you? What do you have to tell me? Oh god. Some sort of fire breathing demon took you and your people out? Oh, he put you in crystals. That's terrible. What a shithead. Is that am I am I reading that right? <laughs> I can't tell. Is that what you're trying to tell me? Can you maybe you know Morse code or anything? Maybe we can hash this out. Alright, well I'm not getting any closer to home. <laughs> I'm continuing to go farther and farther out this time, so. Oh boy. It's going to be time to cut the episode soon anyway. Okay, how handy. These are locked. I need a key to get into them. That's strange. Or maybe I just have to find a locking mechanism of some kind that'll fix it. It's a chair. How objective. I think that was the lock. Yeah, now I can go in here. Looks like there's a lot of treasure to be had. Yeah, money! I love how they're in cells, but it's really just like... Like, they could totally leave if they wanted to, if they feel like jumping to their deaths. It's an interesting kind of jail cell. I wonder how many prisoners would take that option. Like, if you had... Um, like, if you were in prison, and you had a... And you were just in there for life. Or maybe, uh, you know, you were on death row. I, I don't really know if it would make a difference one way or the other. But you had the option there was always the option to go through that one missing wall in your cell to you know just leap to your to your death in a giant colorful bottomless pit <laughs> i wonder how many people would take that option i'm sure some sadistic scientist somewhere did experiments with that at some point It's terrible, they're all dead. But these were like good people, apparently. Wait, they keep respawning. When the crystal respawns, it's still got the person in it. That's weird. Yay, we got another piece. There's a disturbing lack of enemies here. I 
and everything is dead. It's just skeletons everywhere. That's not unsettling at all. Okay, so now I'm going to go back to the surface or I'm going to go deeper into the rabbit hole. Actually, this is a good place to cut the episode, so I'll see you guys next time, and we will continue this extremely colorful journey of love and companionship and crystal dogs that want to kill me. This game is great.